I'm especially proud to serve as Governor of the United States Virgin Islands as we commemorate 100 years as an American territory. It's truly an honor to welcome one and all to share this momentous occasion with us. As the United States Virgin Islands, we have been able to accelerate our economic and social progress. We have most certainly enjoyed many privileges as a result of our affiliation with the world's most powerful nation. However, there's still much work to be done. While we have certainly come a long way since the 1917 transfer, we are yet to be treated as equal Americans in terms of the application of presidential voting rights and a voting voice in Congress. As U.S. citizens living in the Virgin Islands, no matter our place of birth, we are still not eligible for the same benefits as our counterparts living on the U.S. mainland. Contemplating and celebrating our history is important, but the centennial commemoration must also serve as a time to shape our future relationship with the federal government and to determine how we want to grow and evolve over the next 100 years. It's critical that we lay plans now to create economic opportunity, ensure public safety, and improve education. I urge Virgin Islanders to treat the occasion of the transfer centennial as a time of both serious reflection and preparation. Together, we must determine what to accept, what to reject, and how. Given our unique status and history, we can best set a path forward. Our 100th anniversary as a U.S. territory marks a significant milestone in our development, and I look forward to taking part in the many vigorous discussions warranted by this important occasion. I invite all Virgin Islanders, honored guests, and visitors to participate in these conversations and enjoy the centennial events and activities planned throughout 2017. May God continue to bless the United States Virgin Islands.